What's up, team? Team. Just relax and watching TV. I ain't doing nothing special. I ain't doing nothing special. And I got a peeping time behind me. She, you know how people be saying photo bomb? She video bombing me. Why you video bombing me? Bunny ears. <laughs> now, team, my wife mentioned this in the last video. I want to mention this again. We're going, we're having our anniversary issue of Rejoice Essential Magazine going, this is the third year, right, babe? Yeah, three years. Wow. Three years. So we want y'all to send us questions. Email us questions to this email address right here. Ask us anything. Nothing is a dumb question. We're going, and please write your first name. Please, we want your first name, last name, and where you reside, so we can put all that. Or your business, or your ministry. Yeah, yeah, because we want to have that in the mag. We want to have your name in the magazine, saying who the question is from. Now, if you choose to be anonymous, we will make you anonymous, but still submit your question. Right, babe? That's cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, if you want to be anonymous, yeah. Access anything. Remember, we're your favorite couple. So team, I know I look a hot mess. Y'all guys are privileged because y'all get to see the prophets looking some kind of way. They privileged to see you looking a hot mess? <laughs> yes. I must really be privileged. Yes. So you guys, you're not just playing around, but um, this is what, the fourth day? Ben, how many days have I been braiding her hair? I don't know, baby. Yeah, this is like, Mariah, how many days is this? Yeah, I don't know, you guys, but this may be like day number four or something, day number three or four. Yeah, been braiding her hair and um, almost done. Ooh, I'm going to finish this hair tonight. Yeah, we got like a little piece right here left or yeah, a little piece. Yeah, so I'm almost done. And the cool thing about this hair is... What's cool about it, babe? It's blue. It's blue-black. It's by Autry. I'm going to show you guys. It's really cool. I, I really like the hair. Oh, look at this hair, team. <laughs> you imagine me with some hair and I'm Periscope like, Hi, what's up, you guys? Team, do I look like I'm playing, I'm playing that? <laughs> okay. Do I look like I'm... Babe? <laughs> How do I look with blue hair? Nay, babe, don't yay. be single. Don't be single again. I'm just playing. You know, I'm just playing. Yeah, anyways. But yeah, I like this hair. Um, Don't go back to a singles minister. Come on. But it's, uh, yeah. It's by, uh, matter of fact, no, I said by Autry. Uh, no, it's by Premium. You gotta watch that when you bend over. You hold back. That's oh, out. my department. Close the time. I'm sorry. It's by Premium Expression. And yeah, I like it. And had blue. The only one I had was blue there. So, yeah. And Mariah likes colors. And after we finish, can you get your your clamps? It's right there. We're going to put these little, you know, the, the clamp things you put on the braids? Yeah. So, she wanted these. She wanted these guys. But I I, I want the gold. So, yeah. So, we're going to do both? Yeah, we're going to put both. We're gonna do both. So which one do you think we should do, team? The gold clamps? All right, this one is purple, blue, green, and some pink in here. Yeah, which one y'all wanna do, team? And mind you, by the time you answer, it will already have been done. <laughs> He's a vlog, vlog killer. <laughs> I know. Sorry, team. I just, but I keep it real with y'all, team. I keep it real with y'all. I don't I'm say that. I'm trying to uh, kill my hope. For vlogging, it makes me sad. Yeah. Watch so. Top. Yeah. So just got the lighter <laughs> and uh, running the ends. Yeah. Don't ever put hairspray or flammable products and use a lighter because that happens to me one time, and the braid caught on fire and I'm like <sighs> trying to blow it out. Yeah. So that's what I'm doing. So you guys, this is what I've been doing for the last couple of days. Yeah, and 
been writing lots of books and stuff like that. So, yeah, got to multitask. Tonight's dinner was awesome. It was awesome. Me and Babe decided we were going to start eating better and start eating more foods that's lighter. Tonight we had a salad and some baked, some baked potatoes, which was good. And we felt good afterwards. We didn't feel all heavy and like, ah, oh, we got to take a nap because we got itis or something. We didn't feel like that. So we felt good just eating something like, you know. So we, we really want to watch um, what we eat in this season. It needs to be healthier because it's a part of becoming a better you. And that's my series. And guess what? Bae's going to get me for this. But it's always another book in me, right? So anyways, I ain't going to bore you guys. Yeah, Tim, but I'm not, I'm not going to lie to y'all. It's not like I'm never going to get another number two at Wendy's. I just going somewhere else with that. What do you thought I was going a number two. When people say I want number two, I'm like. So I'm telling, I'm telling the team I want a number two. I want, a, I want a number two. I'm telling the team. That. I thought you were talking about you gonna take a number two. But Why would I tell the team that? Yeah, I don't know. Team, team, we might go on a vacation. Team, you know, not really go nowhere, but like just take a month off from y'all. No. No. Absolutely not. We. I'm going to miss you guys. We can't do that. I'm going to miss the team so much. You're going to miss them. Yes. We're, we're cousins, right? We don't got an aunt. We got cousins. <laughs> I ain't seen, speaking of our aunt, I ain't seen our aunt lately. Well, she did like something I put on Facebook today. I put it on here yesterday, but she liked it today. But I ain't seen our aunt. Our aunt don't come around no more. You don't come around no more, Auntie. I ain't gonna say your name, Auntie. You know, you know who you is, Auntie. If you say this, give a wave. If you see this, give a wage, a waving emoji, something, something. We'll I'm make sure our day one people still with us. Y'all still love us. Yes. I want to know the team still. Our cousins, our cousins still love us. All right. Anyway, team, we get back up with y'all. In a little bit. So, team. so today we're going to run a bunch of errands. Uh, a bunch. And today's been busy for me. Uh, on a busy day, actually, and a busy night. <laughs> um, on the way to go run some errands right now. Then I have a Facebook Live interview. Uh, at six o'clock, I think, or six fifteen, I'm not sure. But anywho, uh, then I got a class to teach at seven, and then I gotta finish writing some books that I have to write. So I have time to sleep tonight. Um, I'm probably gonna go to bed like one o'clock to about midnight. I don't be sleepy about midnight. So today, I wrote a window up some. Today I. You know, we try to put on some, something, do something to my face. And I try to get Babe while he was sleeping, but he always catches me. One day I'm going to get him, team. I'm going to just take the camera while he's asleep and get him while he's asleep. Because he always gets me on camera while I'm sleeping. I never hear him. But every time I try to do it to him, he wakes up when I'm on, when I'm, you know, about to get the camera. I'm like, really? I'm like, I'm going to get him. Oh, so day. that was what you were about to do? I was about to do that, yeah. Right. But See? I guess I, I guess I'm too loud. I'm not yeah. quiet enough. Yeah. You're you too know. loud. So I always wake him up. <laughs> but one day I'm gonna show you guys. If I'm just. It ain't possible. With mouth all open and drool, and I'm gonna show you. I don't be I don't be drooling, <laughs> Tim. And them snoring. I don't snore, Tim. Mm -hmm. Well, I do snore, Tim. I don't drool. I don't drool. I ain't gonna lie to y'all.
myself. I had to run to the store and get something. I cooked dinner tonight. I had to run to the store, get some more ingredients. But just riding, you know. But anyway, what I, what I was thinking about was, because uh, a lot of people say, a lot of people say that, and before I even go there with this, I wanna say, no matter what other people say, if you know what God said to you, stand on that. Stand on that. But I, what I was thinking about was a lot of people say, God won't choose your mate. It's an invasion of, of your will. But let me let me tell you something. Y'all y'all already y'all already saw some of y'all already saw my video here. Find you where I talk about Rebecca. Isaac did not choose Rebecca. Abraham did not choose Rebecca. Abraham's servant Eleazar did not even choose Rebecca, though he though he went. God chose Rebecca. God ordered his steps. But that ain't really what I want to talk about. I want to talk about. I know what the Lord told me. And I heard him loud and clear. There's not a doubt in my mind. I woke up one morning. I told this before. But for y'all that's new, I told this before. All right, let me see. When me and Prophet had started conversating in, in 2016, in 2015, I woke up early. One, I woke up one morning, and as soon as I opened my eyes, I heard the Lord say, I'm giving you a wife with the same passion as you. He said it in a whisper, but I don't want to whisper, then you might not hear me. My wife tell me I talk too low. Can't help it if I'm smooth, balanced. I don't be doing all that yelling. But anyway, he said, I'm giving you a wife with the same passion as you. And let me tell you something, I wasn't even talking to the Lord about a wife. I was on his mind. My wife was on his mind. But to know how we met, for y'all that don't know how we met, go back and watch that video. But, you know, even some great men of God, I heard them say, some men of God that I uphold, I heard them say that God won't choose your wife. He won't choose your mate. Look, I don't care what they say. I know what the Lord said to me. And I'll forever stand on that. I'm giving you a wife with the same passion as you. Come on. I thank God for that. All right, team. Anyway, I'm here. I just wanted to say that wasn't no message, no message. I just want to tell y'all what I was I was thinking about. I care what nobody say. Listen, some people say things based off, not even scripture, but based off what God has not done in their life. And I learned that, and I watched that for years in church. A lot of people even preach stuff and say, God won't do this. God won't do that. Only because he have not done it in their life. Don't tell me what God won't do. Come on. All right, team. Good job, later. So tonight, Babe cooked. He made like some pasta with some tomatoes in there. This is good. Okay, I like it. I'm about to get some more, but you guys, my throat is hurting me. I just, I just start getting a sore throat all of a sudden. Like man, it sucks. Yeah. Um. I was kind of disappointed. But anywho, it's an opportunity to glorify God the disappointment. So, that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to get on Periscope and go pray for the sick people to be healed and go prophesy or something. I don't know what's healing. But, I just want to share something with you guys. And I'm very excited. You know, um, 
while we while me and Bay were um, running errands, we had an appointment. While we were running errands, um, the Lord healed this lady. She was sitting next to me. God gave me a word of knowledge about her knees and everything she felt. I felt, and she was like, she just can't walk good. And God healed her, and she just began to praise God right there. And Bay was, me and Bay was thanking God too. It was powerful. Yeah. So we're going to talk about tonight divine interruptions tonight. We're going to talk about that. We're going to talk about that tonight. And uh, yeah, it's going to be awesome. <clears throat> Woo! I like when babe cooks, you guys. I think I ate like three bowls. <laughs> you didn't think it was all that, but I liked it. Yeah, I liked it. And um, I was gonna get on Periscope, but husband told me to wait. So spend time with your family. So yeah, that's one thing about ministers. You gotta be careful. Um, you just gotta take time to spend with our families. And, you know, uh, cause I know a lot of uh, PK, like pastor kids, they hate their parents because they get neglected. So I talked to a lot of people through the body of Christ, did interviews with them, and you know. Uh, when they first started off, they was doing everything, like traveling and stuff like that, and their kids got neglected in the process. So um, they learned to just be there. You know, you can't buy your kids um, love. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to do better, guys. Yeah. So I'm going to go hang out with my babies and my husband. And then when they go to bed, I'm going to go on Periscope and minister. Because in this season, you guys, I have not been able to get on social media minister as much because it seemed like I'm busy busy with other stuff like uh, my publications and stuff like that and speaking of my husband here he is yeah he wants to spend time with me hey guys at nine o'clock we're gonna watch a show it's so shorty. I want to minister for one hour and cut it off so enjoy my husband one hour <laughs> My husband's doing dishes, you guys. Oh. Usually, I'll be the one doing dishes, but tonight, oh, that, that ain't even true. tonight my husband is doing dishes. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, <laughs> He's doing dishes. I like a minute clean up, you guys. Really? All right, team. We about to end this. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I am tired. Went back to my old hometown, got the rest of my photography equipment. My wife was supposed, my helpmate was supposed to help me go get the stuff, you know. But I ain't have no help. I had to, uh, I had to go to the church I was going to over there, get some stuff, and go to my sister's team, house and get me. the rest of the stuff. He left me. And, and team, I had to walk all the way. My, my sister. Wait. Take All the way up some stairs. My, my sister lived on the third. It's a bunch of stairs. Tim. It's you a bunch of stairs. That's, that's it? You just left me? I am tired. Tim. I had that's to make tired. three trips. You left his helpmate. My sister wasn't even home, so I couldn't even get I couldn't get her help or my helpmate's help. I had to do it by myself. I had to go up all them stairs, come back down, bring something to the car. Go back up, bring something to the car. Go back up. That last trip, team, I just, I mean, water was the best thing ever. Hey, you love me? Mm-hmm. You my help, mate? Mm-hmm. You gonna help me? You gonna help me in life? Have I not been helping you? Sit up and lie to the team if you want to. Team, I'm tired. I ain't gonna lie to you, I'm tired. I'm drained. Anyway, anyway, team, catch on the next one. You know, I don't know how often the video is going to come out because we're trying to stay busy. You know, but anyway, we'll catch y'all on the next one. We love y'all. We appreciate y'all. 
Thanks for all the love. Thanks for all the comments. Thanks for all the thumbs up. Family. And if we put together something for next year, like we said before at the beach, we expect y'all to be a part of it. Now we know everybody can't come. Of course not, everybody can't come. And team, when we do this conference this year, I'm having an Empower the Movie conference number two here. I want you to come. Yeah, little my big baby. This is so soft. Anyway, team, we love y'all. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace.